guys and gals. We are very sorry that John McCain kicked the bucket in his first week of presidency. But think about it. At least you now have a MILF in the White House. But seriously, John McCain was a good man, a real maverick with good, rigid American principles and values that I plan to continue going into my God-given tenure as your next Commander-in-Chief. If you haven't noticed, I'm sitting here on my living room couch in Wasilla with your new Vice President, my better half, and my hubby, Todd, and our little baby, Trig. So I jotted down a little presidential to-do list that I wanted to share with you as my State of the Union address. It's a 10-point shopping plan that Todd and I came up together that I'd like to share with you as my presidential agenda. Well, if you haven't noticed, we've moved the Oval Office of the President of the United States from Washington, D.C. to my house here in Wasilla, Alaska. Both me and Todd well, we're just not Washington insiders. You know, we just feel a lot more comfy back at home by Main Street, USA. Energy independence of the United States. Drill, baby, drill. <laughs> oh, I love this one. This is a real favorite of mine. I'm calling this Annie Get Your Gun program. We are putting together a national program to bring firearms into our nation's schools and foster a positive gun culture. In my experience, growing up hunting moose with my dad and wolves and caribou, beaver and polar bears, I found that learning to use a gun has an invaluable tool for instilling self-esteem, strength and responsibility into a young person it's made me the woman I am today. Bring back the militia. It's my goal that every township, every shire, every county in these United States should have a standing militia to preserve the law and protect its nuclear plants. Read my lips, America. No sex. If you are under the age of 18 years old and you are caught having sex or even just fooling around, you'll be sent to jail. We're taking sex out of the schools, period. All sex ed classes will be banned and sex ed books will be burned. In its place in school, we will have increased access to violent games, violent video games, violent movies, and a chance to partake in paramilitary war games and the such. Well, you just have to channel that energy somewhere. Hold it. I gotta get the giggle out. Okay, I'm okay now. Item number six. Global warming. Do nothing. We're taking the when in doubt, do nothing approach to global warming. Because <laughs> frankly, we're really not too worried about it here. Most of these tsunamis, floods, earthquakes, and hurricanes, well, they mostly seem to affect colored people in poor countries like Indonesia and uh, Haiti and uh, New Orleans. We're going to finish the job down south. We're going to go into Mexico and we're going to get ourselves some cheap labor and some good food and margaritas while we're at it. We've been ordering in Chinese all these years. We might as well be ordering in Mexican. Uh -huh. Oh, it's Pablo. Paco or Pablo. Yeah. Huh. He's my new friend. Ah, uh, Paco, you missed a spot. Gals over 18, we're taking our bodies back from the abortion clinics and giving them over to God. Hockey moms, struggling Sally, Wendy the waitress, let's 
say you're spending the night playing hide the salami with Joe Sixpack. Maybe Joe had one too many and forgot to put on his raincoat. You know what I'm saying? Or maybe he followed you home from the bar and forced you in a cor and forced you into a corner and when you didn't want to and knocked you up. Well, you know how guys can be like that. So we want you guys out here, gals out there, to know that we care about your bodies and your right to do exactly as God wants you to do. Hack the baby. That's why we've created Bub, Bureau for Unwanted and Unplanned Babies. That's right. And we're setting up a 24-hour drop-off service so you can have your baby and drop it off. Item number nine, ice, 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 ice. Uh -huh. Everybody go to Iceland, okay? Yeah, isolationation. I so cool. Todd, I, I love you. I love America. Ice. <laughs> <laughs> I love this country, land of the free. Woo, woo. <laughs> <laughs> Item number 10, we're establishing a Department of Armageddon and of World Affairs in these last days, these end times. We need a special task force to ensure for a smooth transition for true believers at the time of the rapture and the last judgment and to ensure that all those non-believers are going to hell, directly to hell.